what you see now here is animal puke and if you zoom in closer these are coffee beans now have you ever wondered how these beans come out as puke of this animal I have Annie here yeah. Hello, good morning. who is going to explain how this coffee is made. Yes. So, the animal, the seafood cat, or we call Luwak, they live in the jungle, 60 kilometers from here, the plantation. They eat the coffee berry, the best one, because the bean cannot rise, so fermentation in the stomach, and then cook like this one. For Luwak coffee, low acid, low caffeine. Because natural fermentation in the stomach of the animal, they have a good enzyme to reduce the acid and caffeine. We try in the sun, it's about 3 days, 5 days or maybe more. Depend of the winter, because sometimes raining or cloudy. And this after we wash, and then we dry again. After that, we peel the skin like this. So they have to layer skin, hard skin, and then the soft skin until the green bean inside, that's the coffee bean so the bean still hygienic, they're not contact direct with the food that's after we peel the skin and then we're roasting inside it's about 4 hours with the temperature until 120 degrees Celsius no? so, yeah. so the roasting machine after we peel the coffee, the green bean we put the bean inside, maximum 2 or 3 kilo and then we lock we burning by gas for hours and then we control the temperature here until 120 degrees Celsius. We so that's the coffee berry, but this one type the robusta because Arabica they must grow in the highland, top of mountain, robusta they grow easier in the lowland or flatland. So the animal, but this one. Then because they are nocturnal animals, so during the day they are sleeping. In here we feed them with banana, papaya, all kinds of sweet fruit. Because the skin of the coffee berry sweet, so they like it sweet fruit also. That's Annie all the way from Indonesia, Borobudur. Thank you.